Welcome to WatchGuard's Daily Security Byte. I'm Corey Nockreiner. Today's story is shady Chrome fonts. In a blog post, a researcher from NeoSmart Technologies shared a new attack that kind of targets Chrome with a social engineering trick to lure people to download malware. Essentially, this researcher found a hijacked WordPress page. And when he visited this page, the text on the page turned into random characters and was unreadable. Apparently, behind the scenes, there was some JavaScript created to make the text appear unreadable. Now, more interestingly, when this happened, uh, the victim would get a pop-up that essentially said that Chrome was missing a font. If you want to read this page, you have to download and install a new font. Now, this sort of social engineering lure is nothing new. You've probably seen attacks that ask you to download a video codec or some other plugin in order to get a page to work. And often, these are just tricks to get you to download malware. But what the researcher found interesting about this was the extra trick of actually creating the page so that it was unreadable, rendering it unviewable, which helps sell the story that maybe you do need an additional font. Now, of course, this really was malware, even though the pop-up looked kind of like a legitimate Google pop-up. If you actually downloaded the file, you would get a .exe file. And of course, if you ran the file, you would be infected by malware. And it appears that this particular uh, malicious file isn't really well caught by many AV vendors out there, and even Chrome's safe browsing mechanism, which sometimes prevents you from downloading malicious files, wasn't able to cache this particular file. In any case, I just found this to be an interesting new social engineering trick. Now, do note this is not a flaw in Chrome in particular, it's just that this particular JavaScript attack seems to target Chrome browsers based on the pop-ups it uses and things like that. And really, it's JavaScript that make these sort of pop-ups and the rendering of text on readable possible. So how do you protect yourself from this? Well, obviously you should have some user education around your users not downloading uh, weird applications that pop-ups tell them do. But more importantly, you should have some uh, sort of proactive malware detection, something like WatchGuard's APT blocker that can catch new, never before seen malware even without signatures. If uh, AV vendors miss this particular threat, things like APT blocker might still be able to catch it and block it. Anyways, I found it very interesting. Be sure to check out the researcher's blog post for more details. That's it for today's story. Thank you for watching.